Hello everybody, and welcome back to Paradise of Monsters Mysterious Caves, with yours truly, and Lorgon111. Hello, hello. Hello. So, we have re-geared a bit in preparation for this volcano area. Would you like, would you care to show off what you've got, sir? I've got the Protection 3 Skulls, an Unbreaking 2 Protection 1 Iron Chest Plate, some Fire Protection Pants, and some Protection mm -hmm. 3 Diamond Boots that I did some repairing on. And you've brewed up some Fire Resist Potions, so I've got them. Oh, I've yes. got Splash Potions, Vincent Health, and a Water Bucket. We are geared to the teeth right now, and I, it feels pretty good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I came down here with one of our tulips to punch up some of the magma creams so we could make some fire resist pots so we each have three of the eight minute guys. Um, that and our water buckets should hold us over pretty well in this area, I'm guessing. Mm -hmm. And last time we made a bit of progress kind of like progressing down the left and so I think we'll just mm -hmm. kind of like pick up from there. Yeah, sounds good to me. And so for these loot chests that have the TNT around them out mm -hmm. in those pillars... I assume we want to try to check those out before yeah, we start. Yeah, that's actually a good idea. Stuff, this right? one looks pretty passive, other than kind of like right at the top. Should we go ahead mm -hmm. and just try to get that one? If you want to, yeah. Uh, the blazes might set the TNT on fire. Oh. There's there's a spawner behind I you. I just realized oh, there's diamond that's... ore by those. Uh, oh yeah. Right. I was just looking at the chest and the TNT. I and don't I think that I. Ignored. There were so many monsters when we first came in here that I didn't really take a good look uh, yeah. around the area. I think I failed to notice that. Wow. Yeah, so in any case, like I was going to say the blazes might set off the TNT, but apart from that... Ooh, that is a good point. Um, but I think if they're shooting at us, like, when we're farther away, like, that's unlikely to happen. It's only when we get in nice and mm -hmm. close. I don't know if we should want to, like, pillar or ladder up there, or if we want to, like, try to bridge across. Which do you I'm think almost is... tempted to try enderpearling over there and be oh. all flashy about it. Wee, okay, yeah, I was going to say, I didn't bring any <laughs> enderpearls along with me, but if you want to try that, uh, I would, yeah, I, I'll I've, have a great camera angle for it. Me. All right, let's see if and I can... And you've got a good fast pick, right? you got, like, efficiency three at least uh, or something? Yep, efficiency three. Okay. It's not too bad. Let's see if I can at least get the angle right on this pearl. And I'm over. Nice work. Boom. Oh, I right, killed the guy behind though. you. Okay, don't set things on fire, guy. Get out of here. Nice. Woohoo! I did it! All right, so the chest has a meh bow and some arrows. I but we see. have diamond. So there's Indeed. That. I don't remember if we had any fortune picks. Well, I guess a little late now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. I don't remember um, having them off the top of my head, but... Uh, I think we have a fortune book, possibly, but... Yeah, I could Well, remember. we have two diamonds now. Anyway. There's there's quite a few others. All uh, right, and did we leave around. a chest, like, near the beginning? Actually, there's some kind of chest over here. Did we ever open this up? I don't think we did. Um, what does it say? Cobweb Destroyer. Hmm. Oh, speaking of which, I just heard a spider fall and die. Oh, it's an Unbreaking Ten Wooden Sword. Okay. Oh, that makes sense. okay. That works. Well, I will, I guess I'll put the diamonds in there for the time being and the meh bow. Mm -hmm. And I guess we can keep sweeping off to the left. Yep, that sounds good. So just as a recap for last time, we have secured two of these towers here. I think I left the key in this first one and then I've secured the second key in my ender chest. There's another one, one of these one antidote one. potions laying on the ground. Um, right. I forget what those have on them. It, like, I, it's got I, hunger, I, weakness, slowness, blah, 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 but three mm -hmm. minutes of, uh, re or three seconds of regen. Uh, I think removes lower effects of all these potions. I've run across something like that in other maps where even though it has the negative effects, I think it's right. customized. I think in a it way basically, where it yeah, it like kills all the effects because like they only last for like one second or something. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, so it's basically. Well, it, it could be useful. Yeah, like, if you get hit by like a witch and you're gonna be poisoned for the next minute or something like. It could right. Be useful if this was a particularly so. witchy area, I'd be pretty likely to keep that. But all right, there's a few more of those antidote poisons. Just I'm just gonna leave them on the ground for right now since they're just okay. like, named whatevers. All right, so here's another one of these really bad places. Mm -hmm. It seems like most of the bad spawners are up above, and then the lower section has... Yeah, I'm running in and just oh, adding some oh. light, but I'm going to run back out. All right. Do a little bit of the same. I've got my own antidote. It's called light. <laughs> antidote to all mobs. That's right. Well, well all mobs. a lot of them. <laughs> oh, <it's> most. <laughs> uh, Maybe okay, not all got... the blazes and silverfish oh. and things, but... Man, look at all the guys just pouring out of there. So there are a few spawners along the side uh, of this area as well, kind of down closer to the lava. Looks like some spider spawners. Yeah, I broke I broke one of those actually just a minute, moment mm -hmm. ago as we were kind of like walking over here. Okay. I think I'll do what I can to take some of these out. Oh, you're bad. Ow. Caused me some trouble, skeleton. 
I thought I was better geared than I am, but I still take a lot of damage relatively quickly. Hmm. I, I guess I still have. Like, I guess they've all been focused on you. I guess. All right, yeah, so good I job, Chain mail, and I don't have a helmet that actually gives any t-shirts on. To right, me. right, right, right. There's a food chest down here. Oh, there Hello. are poisony spiders. I hear you. Oh, I thought that creeper was gonna blow. Thought so gonna wh pop. where are you uh, working right now? I'm okay, just kind of working there. around the tower still. Oops. Oh, all right, hey, the light is doing a good job at negating the spiders because he just walked right past me. Oh, true. They just kind of derp around like they don't know what's happening. So there's also a spawner on the very top of these, it looks like. Yeah, there's a skeleton spawner. That oh, I, I didn't see that one. That's where the skeletons are coming from. Okay. Yeah. I was just thinking oh. that all myself. All right, well, now I'm going to go get that. All right. Uh, I need to eat some food for just a second. I'm going to up there. Play is over there. Because I've got this great, uh, the Martel sword that we got from one of the previous areas that's really oh, good against great. undead. I forgot about that. Okay, so you have pretty much, uh, okay. taken out this whole I guess you went inside stuff. the previous one. I didn't go inside it to kind of understand how all the spawners were laid out in here, oh, but right. now I do. And good the spawners point. are going bye-bye. And then I think it's the chest up at the top that has the key, and then there's usually chest on the ground floor that has hopefully some loot or something. Okay, there is, uh, good boy. There's a uh, cactus guys being spawned inside here. Did you encounter yep. that in the previous one? Yes. So are it they like the guys, presumably? Um, you can go ahead and kill that one because we have at least okay. one other for farming if we Got care it. to. I believe right. they're all the same. And if I can get some more light in here, that would be great. Uh, but I think that's good enough for now. Okay. All right. I will try to clean up the surrounding area a little bit here. Oh, so many spiders. Oh, and I'm in a spider web. That is uh, not a good place for a Cthulhu. Walking into spider webs. Let's do without that, please. And I don't seem to be getting poisoned. I haven't changed the difficulty at all. I but... didn't notice if I got po I There was a lot of light around it when the spiders, so I'm not sure if any of the cave spiders like actually bit me, but um, mm -hmm. yeah, in any no. case, that will definitely... Definitely on normal now. Yep. It wasn't before, it is now. All right, but I think that area is pacified. The uh, crazy zombies in there. They still walk their way out. I'm just adding some more light down the left-hand side. Oh boy, okay, there's another big tower. Man, there's more uh, magma cubes than you can shake a stick at down here. Yeah, I broke a couple of the spawners because I figure. Yeah, that's we've got fire one pots, and we've got a few unlocked down already. Exactly, we've got one close to the entrance as well, so I'm not too worried about it. Ooh, ooh, these guys kind of kind of hurt when you get all uh, surrounded by them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I didn't go down inside there. I shouldn't have, <laughs> but I did. I figured it's lit up. It's good. Oh, I didn't realize we're really close to a pillar that has a gas spawner on it. And thankfully, we're not in range, but I need to keep an eye on I that. I see. All right. Good. Um, I'm going to pop a golden apple because I'm not regening fast enough for my liking. Okay, spiders, where are you coming from? Because it needs to end. I just broke it's a couple of spider spawners over here. Right, okay. I think that's what they were anyway. I'm definitely getting poisoned mm. now, so that's working. <laughs> <laughs> we are confirmed on the poison aspect of things. And... So there's, there's this one big cobble pillar here that's got some kind of spawner up on the top. All and right. It's, you want to try to Unlike climb other it, pillars. Or... I'm going to pillar up I'll try to keep blazes see. off of you and um, anything else that I see coming out immediately. All right. While you're pillaring up. I got... Oh, it's another one of the... Uh, Bad potion spawners, I believe. Ah, uh, I see. So it's dead now. But is there any loot up there? There is not. Okay. Well, that's odd. All that's right. Fine. It might just be to prevent so... us from going over the area somewhat or something. I don't know. Yeah, that could be. All right. I think we should go, yeah, through. There's one more of these boxes that's kind of straight ahead along the left hand side. So I'm going to try to light mm -hmm. up around it. Uh, okay. And once we have that secured. I think we can kind of like step back and take a look at the overall area again and decide if we want to go towards the middle or what we want to do. I think that works. If I remember the flavor text correctly from those keys, we have to have all six to be able to get into the uh, I see. Uh, volcano, so we may not have a choice in the matter. Really. I've forgotten about that from last time, right. So it may be a little bit of a, uh, a little bit of a grind. slugfest here right. to get through and I get all I think we're on. well enough equipped, though, that I, I think confidence. so, yeah. As long as I don't put myself in too okay. silly of a situation. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me back off there for just a second. So yeah, I'm just going to be 
killing spawners with reckless abandon here. Okay, so that area is open now. Oh, blaze above you. I'll get him. Oh, yep. All right, everybody die. Nice. Thankfully, a lot of these cobwebs in here actually kind of help you out if they can trap the mobs. Mm -hmm. Ooh, ow. Okay, you need to die. You need to die. There we go. Okay. Oh, this is more my first time. Ground. Ooh, nice. This is my first time trying to work my way up from the bottom, and it was kind of it was a little more interesting. I see. Put it that nice way. Work, creeper. Did you uh, grab the key from the last one we just cleared? I did not. Okay. Oops. I'm grabbing this one. Okay, sounds good. Um, I did my usual kind of thing where I kind of light up and kill mobs and I figure I'm going to get the loot at the end. Sure. Do you have a water bucket on you in this area? I do. Do you need okay. one? Okay. No, there was okay. one in the loot chest here, okay. so seemed opportune. Yeah. You will rarely find me without a water bucket if such <laughs> things are available. Especially in areas like this. I should have known better. Oh, hey, we got a jockey. Don't see you guys very often. A spider jockey or a chicken zombie? A uh, spider jockey. I see. Okay, I took out another one of these little spider dens with all the spawners in them. I see, very good. Somebody over here. More antidotes on the ground. Okay, so that is four towers now? If that's the case... Yeah, I don't know that we have to get all of them. I think maybe there's more not. towels than, uh, than we need. I Which see... would make sense, because, you know, if a creeper blew one up or something like that, it would right. be weird if you had to get... You lost any little piece of loot that you couldn't complete the area or something. Game over, right? Yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna do the old Brian tactic, run around and light things. Then promptly run away again. Bravely run away. I think as a result of... Either this or just like whatever other things I've been doing lately. Like I'm getting better with the bow, I think. Oh yeah, well, a, happy. a map like this where there's so many spawners around, you really got to step back and practice your archery. Mm -hmm. Oh, oops. Okay, I'm in some trouble here. All right, oh. big bandit cubes. They hurt. They hurt. Where, uh, where are you? I'm over by. I'm stuck in some webs back by the previous tower. Oh, okay. I can use some help if I can get help. Yeah. Let's see if I'm, I can find I'm in trouble. You. Previous, previous tower. Uh, all right. I think I, I managed to get myself out. I was stuck in the webs, but <laughs> I okay, did not there see you at all. Shoo, I'm right behind you. Oh, okay. I, I <sighs> walked right by that tower and I didn't see any Brian's. I was stuck in a cobweb and their giant magma cube had spawned, and they they do Ooh, a lot of damage. They they do hit surprisingly hard. Oh, were you down below here? Yeah, I'd gone down. Oh, I was looking in the tower. And okay. I fell right in the. Gotcha. All right. There well, are I'm... a lot a lot of cubes spawning down there. Regenning some health. I'm going to. Uh... Drop off some extra loot back in the chest at the start. Right. So I've got two and a half minutes of fire resist left. I gotta remember that. Man, I really, I haven't been able to really take in this area very much, but I really enjoy the the ceiling with all the the lava stalactites hanging hanging around up there. Oh yeah. I wonder if anything, like if we reflect like a gas fireball up there or Ooh. something else updates some blocks up there, I wonder if it's possible that those will all start flowing down. So we should be wary of that. so. That would not surprise I me. I really, yeah, th kind of think all that through. All right, what does that say? Food. Okay, I don't need food. Oh, yeah, one of those loot chests yeah, down there. Yeah, one of those loot chests like down on the side. All right, so I'm clearing out another tower. It's going relatively well. Uh oh, and then I got bumped in. <laughs> Going less well. All right, I'm coming back in reserve to help. All right. No matter how safe you think you are, there's always some mob that finds their way behind you and gives you a little love tap inside of something. Love tap, Never baby fail. love. Tap. <laughs> um, crummy loot there. All right, Creeper, right. help me out. I don't know if that's their strong suit. Ah, uh, they just blew up two of the spiders. That was for, oh, okay. Good. I was going for three, but I'll take two. <laughs> two for three is not bad. Yeah, that's right. All right, get this junk out of my inventory, please and thank you. All right, so that tower is cleared and key secured. So that puts us at 
five keys secured okay. in some way, shape, or form. All right, so I guess if we advance to the next tower, yeah, I think probably yeah, about halfway around. And, and it looks like there keys. are a total of three more towers at least, so that is good to know. So I can get one blown up if I feel like it. <laughs> if you feel like it. <laughs> if, if I want a, a little more of a challenge, I might. All right, and I'm still healing back up because I took a lot of damage right there from some poison, but I will be uh, yeah. back behind you in just a moment. All, All right, right, I was just talking about how I'm better with the bow, and then I just missed like six shots in a row. <laughs> Shouldn't so have said anything. Maybe I should not have said anything. Exactly. Nope. That's what I'm thinking. Mum's the word. Oops. You know, this really isn't too bad of an area. It's, it's a little spider heavy if you get towards the... Uh, the rim of this area because of all the right. lower um, down spawners. Yeah. But... And yeah, I our gear is definitely helping too. Like having right. some diamond gear, having like prot three and a couple of things. And... I think we're ooh, I, I think I might have sorted you there. I see. Oh, thanks for mentioning it. Okay, I'm getting a little uncomfortable with what's <laughs> happening right now. Oh Let's no, it's back fine. up. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> things were escalating rather quickly there somehow. I guess on my on my shoes, all I have is uh, feather falling, so I don't have any type of protection on that front. I see. I yeah, I just put Pro have... three in the diamond boots, mm -hmm. and so that extra protection. Yeah, that is not a bad lot. idea. Although, yeah, I don't know that we have any other protection books or anything to like do any more of that. So not that I know of. No, we haven't really come across a ton of books lately. But yeah, I like how we have just a bunch of anvils and then some random books and some random other things that we farmed up from mobs in right. order to put it together. Like, it's been fun, and it's actually like, I mean, I was I was giving it some thought. I was thinking about, you know, like, what's the best thing that I can do with my levels? Because last episode, I think I had, like, mm -hmm. 38 levels, and then I started this episode oh, wow. probably with, like, five. Because I spent them all on those Yeah, it, make, it makes you choose a little bit more other than right. just, oh, I'm just going to dump a bunch of levels into right. enchanting. See I like I the strategic aspect. Makes you think about it a little bit more. All right, so I believe most of the spawners in this next tower are killed, but I do have the key regardless. All right. So, Oops, sorry. <laughs> I <do>. your, <laughs> your bow works well. Ding. <laughs> <laughs> the ding means success. Okay, you get out of here. I just want to see if there's any decent loot in here before we fall back. Sounds good. Um, eh, there's kind of, there's a looting diamond sword. It's not the worst thing ever. So if we want to, we could drop back and grab the rest of the keys. Yeah, I think we should or, do that. Or actually, maybe before that, we should find where they go, so we're not carrying. Oh, I them figured it was the center. I didn't look carefully at the. I I would assume so, but as far as actually getting there without dying right. and stuff, you know, making a a safe path and all that. Right, that sounds good. I'm taking out a few more of the spawners that are kind of closer to the rim, sure. kind of along the way. And then we're also going to want to secure some more of these pillars, I'm assuming. Because if we... We have gold block. I can't remember if we've placed it yet or not. But I know we have it. Mm -hmm. And then the diamond block we could easily get here. Especially if we use fortune. <laughs> instead of just I going at it with... A bit. something... It might be like an error in the client. But it looks like something mm -hmm. purple flying through the top of the volcano. Just like repeatedly. Like there's a... Mm -hmm. A dispenser or projectile or something like shooting potions or something i see no such thing i don't know oh, it might oh, be one of those oh. weird client glitches i think i did just see what you were talking about i Almost was like a I was, shoot star yeah, or something. i'm not sure exactly what i think maybe i'm gonna start pillaring up towards uh one of these tall gassed pillars okay and i'm just gonna make a ladder but try to stay out of the range of the gas just to, like start getting close to it i think Sure. I will... Let's see. Oh, I think I may have missed one of our uh, keys here. So I'm going to try to gather up all those, and then I will join you in your endeavors. Okay. There it is. All right. So I've got four on me. One more is back here, and then one is in my ender chest. And I guess I don't have any easy access to an ender chest yet, which is kind of annoying. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Take a dip. I was taking out a magma cube spawner, and I got surprised by one of the magma cubes that uh. spawned. They frighten me more than anything else. I think they're a little less glitchy now than they used to be. Like they used to be like super mm -hmm. glitchy. Really, I don't remember that. Glit glitchy how? 
like on in server play or whatever like they would just kind of oh like true bounce around and be hard to hit or whatever i think it's safe to say oh, most uh, all right um crap oh uh potion uh i'm okay okay um, <laughs> i took eight hearts of damage from the fall Ooh. but i'll live oh so it was a fall into uh the gas knocked me off i didn't realize he was gonna spawn <laughs> i thought it was a fall into lava oh no can't take a feather falling potion. Well, <laughs> no, the, the jump boost potion doesn't give any feather falling effect. It, it does, does, actually. Uh, oh, it the does? leaping potions uh, do cause you to take less fall damage, I believe. Interesting. Okay, so I guess and you could so, take a potion. Yeah, I don't know if you've been watching any of uh, Pantheon that some other folks have been playing. I haven't. Um, but no. they have a lot of places where they have silverfish spawners that are like on the ceiling, and the silverfish potions or the silverfish spawn mm. with the jump boost, and basically <laughs> so they can fall but not die from the fall, and then kind of like surprise the players. I think. Oh man, that is pretty clever. I really like how map makers have embraced a lot of the newer mechanics and done really cool things with them. It's it's mm. fun to see what can be done nowadays. Right. And yeah, a lot of those yeah mechanics have been designed well to yeah kind of like give the flexibility exactly. to those different things. All right, so now that that gas spawner just spawned something, I think I'll be mm -hmm. safe to climb up a little bit closer, but now I know just how close it is. So I have all six keys we need. I'm bringing them a little bit closer forward, and I'll stash them somewhere safe-ish. Safe-ish. Oh, oh Ish. I just fell off the thing again. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll say we'll say a gas knocked you off. That's right. We'll, we'll pretend that that's what it was. An invisible we'll not pretend that it's for I forgot to hit shift because I was trying to lean over and press uh, put a torch on the side. All right, so I I'm here, uh, bow ready. If you want to climb the ladder, or uh, I wouldn't do it with all the keys in hand or whatever. Nope, um, I, I but if you want to climb the, the ladder that I made and just uh, start okay. um, trying to bridge across to that gas, and sure. meanwhile I'll be aiming at him. Let me actually go ahead and fire an Since arrow just to make sure I'm aiming in the right spot. So I need to be careful about right. setting that off. 